down a slope. It says in another hadith, yeah. when he walks. And yakhtu, we did it in hadith of Sayyidina Ali, yakhtu takaffu'a, takaffu'a kana yalhat min sabab. So he walks in a way, it's as if he's coming down an incline. He says many things, that he can, he could have the Prophet Sayyidina Sallam slightly inclining forwards, and then has the Prophet Sayyidina slightly moving from side to side when he walks, Allah Alaihi Wasallam, but he does walk with force. That's part of the meaning of what? Of takaffu'a kana ma yalhatu min sabab. But also he mentions here, it interjects with وَيَمْشِي هَوْنًا هَوْنًا is light. He's very gentle when he walks upon the earth. وَعِبَادَ الرَّحْمَانَ الَّذِينَ يَمْشُونَ عَلَى الْأَرْضِ حَوْنًا وَإِذَا خَاتُمُ الْجَاهِلُونَ قَالُوا سَلَامًا Allah said, the ibad of al-Rahman, they're the ones who walk upon the earth. هَوْنًا They're very gentle when they walk upon the earth. Huh? They walk with tranquility upon the earth. The walk of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Huh? And in the tradition, the walk of Sayyidina Fatima Zahra Alayhi Wasallam. But the walk of Fatima Zahra, it could not be distinguished from the walk of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Mentioned by the great woman. When he walked, he walked with concentration. He was known neither to press forward and nor falter. Gathered. And he gathered. And he gathered. He gathered. He was concentrated. But he's very, very gathered. And he's together physically. He's together mentally. That's concentrated. He's together spiritually. Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Okay? The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. He's not fragmented like, like us. Nature of us, we just, as we walk down the street, <laughs> fragmented physically. Yeah, oh, my, oh, my mind's everywhere. <laughs> yani, khalas, all fragmentation. Like your soul has been yani, destroyed, yani, blasted to smithereens, as they would say. Huh? But the Rasul, one. Mm, that's the slave of the one. In Allah Ta'ala, you have al-Witr. In Allah Ta'ala, witr, you have al-Witr. Huh? Allah Ta'ala is one, and he loves those who are one with him. Imam Ahmad Zaruk, rahimahullah ta'ala, take this to tradition. Strength is no power. And it is Abu Hurairah, and when Mera'i to Ahmed Asra'i, we never saw anybody who moves quicker, walk quicker than the Messenger of God, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Wa sallam. Wasi' al khat in the tradition. Wasi' al khat. Wasi' al khat in the steps between each other. They die, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. The Prophet, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, was the Mishihi, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, and then Artut wa lahu. It's as if the air has just been folded up to the Prophet as he walks. Like he's about, as we say, conveyor belt. As if he's about a conveyor belt as he walks. Sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam. The air was folded up to the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa But not in the sense here. As if he said, it's a, more, it's a more metaphor for the speed by which he walks. But at the same time, the air was folded up to the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. that the air was all folded up from the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Verily, we would once, in Abu Huraira, said we would go to lands to keep up with the Prophet and he was cool, calm, and collected. We can break into a sweat. And the Sahaba literally would have to like, to keep with the Messenger of God, you have to keep moving. And what made it more difficult for the companion was that the Prophet walked from behind. The Prophet Sallallahu didn't walk from the front, and he didn't walk amongst them. So I leave my back. And he was why I leave my back for the angel. The other why he walked behind him, and the companions would complain, Ya Rasulullah, why is he always walk from behind? And the Prophet Sallallahu said, because I have your back, and the angels have mine. The Prophet Sallallahu So that's difficult for them if he's walking from behind. Because now you've got to keep, not just up with him, you've got to keep, quote unquote, ahead of him. You can't be slack at the top of the front end. You can just slack behind and you know what I mean? Catch your breath or what have you. And you've got to keep right in front of the Messenger of God, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, the speed at which he walks, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, supreme power. And that's just the only khalas, what we're given access to. But the Prophet, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, speaks with Ahlul Khatwa, and Ahlul Khatwa, the people of the step, that they can take one step and they wherever they want to be. Ahlul Khatwa, Ghazali, Rahim Allah Ta'ala. And they just walk off that. They just heirs of the Prophet, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. The Prophet says of literally one step, and he's at the Sidra. Another step, he's at the Rafra. Another step, he's Qadr Hussein, the Ebna, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. That's the steps of the Messenger of God, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Uh, 